Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm going to tell you how you can earn £10,000 per month working in Hong Kong. That's £10,000, US dollars or £100,000 Hong Kong dollars. Here's how you can do it. Teaching is paid relatively well in Hong Kong compared to other places around the world. If you are a newly qualified teacher, you can expect to earn about three and a half thousand pounds per month in salary. However, some schools do give you a monthly allowance and some teaching programs give you an allowance of up to two thousand pounds every month. That brings your total income to around five and a half thousand pounds per month for being newly qualified. The good thing about teaching in Hong Kong is that your salary actually increases year on year and although the increases are quite small, it does add up over time. So if you have five years experience, your salary and your allowance is going to add up to about six and a half thousand pounds per month. If you have 10 years experience, or you are working in Hong Kong and you build up to 10 years experience, your base salary is going to be about 66,000 Hong Kong dollars, or six and a half thousand pounds per month. Of course, your allowance is 2,000 pounds per month on top of that. There are some bonuses there as well. So your base salary, your allowance on the bonus structure, all added together means you can earn £10,000 per month teaching in Hong Kong if you have 11 or 12 years experience. Pilot. Pilots have been exceptionally well paid in Hong Kong over recent years. The past couple of years due to COVID, the aviation industry has been decimated. However, pilots can still make some good money. New contracts being offered to pilots in Hong Kong now means that newly qualified second officers can expect to earn around 30,000 Hong Kong dollars per month or 3,000 pounds per month, while first officers can expect to earn just below 5,000 pounds per month or just below 50,000 Hong Kong dollars. However, if you have the experience or you work your way up to captain, your starting salary is probably going to be around 85,000 Hong Kong dollars per month, which is about 8,000 pounds. And that can go up to 10,000 pounds, 11,000 pounds, 12,000 pounds, depending on the years of experience that you have. So yeah, pilots can still earn a lot of money, especially working in Hong Kong. And when we do get back to normal, I expect Hong Kong to once again become one of the busiest airports anywhere in the world. The number one job industry in Hong Kong for earning over £10,000 per month is of course finance. Now what you need to do for a finance job in Hong Kong is actually to get the experience overseas in your home country or elsewhere and then get transferred to Hong Kong. So I know people who have come to Hong Kong who have five or six years experience working in finance in the UK, in New Zealand, Australia, America. They then get transferred to Hong Kong and their salary is in excess of 100,000 Hong Kong dollars per month. That means their salary in Hong Kong is over 10,000 pounds every single month. Transfers in finance usually come about in two ways. Either your company will transfer you to Hong Kong or your company will ask if anyone wants to transfer to Hong Kong. If you get recruited from within Hong Kong, you're going to be put on a local contract, which means your salary package is not going to be as good as if you are working overseas and get transferred from Hong Kong. So it's vitally important that you get the experience in your home country or overseas and then transfer to Hong Kong. Some of the roles that are going to get you in excess of £10,000 per month include project manager, client advisor and roles within risk management okay guys that is it three jobs that you can most definitely do here in hong kong to earn in excess of ten thousand pounds every single month i just want to thank you for watching the video if you have any questions or feedback please leave me a comment below and please hit the subscribe button so i can talk to you again and i will see you next time bye bye